Hey guys, welcome to my first video and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to install Craft CMS. So the first thing that you need to do is visit the Craft CMS website and then press the download button. Right. And then after you download it, you need additional uh, tools to in order to install it. So the first one, you need a mem pro, uh, you need a mem which is a software that uh, that contains a PHP, MySQL, Apache and basically it is available for Mac OS X and Windows. The next software you need is SQL Pro which is a graphical user interface. Uh, you know it's just a software that allows you to access the access your database without the command line. Next you need an Atom text edit uh, you need any text editor, it can be Atom, Sublime Text and lastly you need a terminal so in this case i will bring to use item 2 which is my favorite all right so once you download it open it and copy these two for two files into the into the folder that you want to uh, the folder that you have created all right so just basically just copy it like that and then the next step, open your mem or mempro. In this case, I'm going to use mempro with the same software with extended ex uh, extended features. So you will see this page. After that, go to the host tab. Right, press these icons and select the public folder. So I save my my craft CMS, the, the one that I have just downloaded just now into the documents and then I create a, a, a folder which is tutorial and I copy the these two files so select the public folders and press choose alright so after that press the start and add your password once it's in press this web start alright so it will bring you to this uh, default, uh, default site Okay, so once you are here, now we need to log in to the database using the SQL Pro that I have just told you just now. All the link will be linked in the description. So go to the socket, username root and password root. Test connection, connection success, connect it. So once you are in, head back to the website that we have just launch and then go to the localhost slash uh, localhost 8888 all right then press enter so it will say that service is unavailable so there are few few things that uh, that makes this uh, service unavailable so the first thing that you have to do is open your text any text editor that you have In this case I'm going to use atom press the public folder and drag it right there Actually, we need both. Okay, so let me just uh, remove it. So I will drag both. I mean, drag one of it here. So in these two folder, open the public fo public folder, and then press the rename the HT access and put dot in front of it. Right. So public slash dot HT access. Enter, and then. You don't have to save it or anything just like close it like that and then the next one go to the craft folder config database all right so you are here you need to set the database that you have already created so the thing that you need to do is just like now we need to create a new database which is go here and press add database then just write a uh, tutorial uh, tutorial database and then database encoding would be UTF Unicode and choose the last one here. So this this one you can find in the Craft CMS installation page. Press add, right? So tutorial is the database name. Go back to the files that we want to edit, which is the database.php. The database name should be tutorial username root password root right to save it right once you save it now you need to open your terminal in this case I'm going to use item 2 
and go to the folder Alright, so in this file we have two which is craft and public. We need to make sure that the craft some of the uh, let me show you craft. We need to make sure that the app uh, config and storage are uh, rewritable. So ch mod recursive seven let's see 744 right make it 744 app folder then we have config folder and last one storage oh, ch mod I spelled it wrongly ch mod alright so once we we have done this when uh, go back to the browser and then press slash admin alright so if uh, you will see this screen and just select the installation, use your username, uh, tutorial, and password, press next, set name, tutorial, localhost. Alright, I think this looks good. Finish up and it will start installing it it won't take you it won't even take a minute okay so let's see all right so all is done just press button and then as you can see you are inside the dashboard of the craft cms uh, of the admin the admin dashboard that you have just installed and when you press here you will see your uh you will see your local host you will see your main page okay so everything works fine all you have to do is just uh, create the theme that you want and that's all so thanks for watching and see you next time